It's an amazing accomplishment for the 28-year-old mother of two who has no record label, especially after all she's been through. Um, my boyfriend murdered my husband. You see, Kim is the survivor of domestic abuse by an ex-boyfriend, a man who is now serving six years in prison for murdering her ex-husband before her eyes. Yeah, that was my tragedy through that altercation. I was in the hospital um, after I was stabbed uh, three times and I had a, a lot of facial injuries. I actually had reconstructive surgery. My nose was broken in four places. Yeah, it was a terrible experience. Now she's looking forward to the Junos next month and the happy ending to her story of survival. It just didn't seem feasible or realistic as a career. And, you know, slowly we started recording and writing collectively, and here I am. <laughs> I don't even really know how I got here. <laughs> Kim believes she has a responsibility to talk about her tragic past so that other young women won't repeat her journey. I try to be involved as much as possible, mentoring and educating, um, you know, children and women who have been in um, abusive relationships and just getting them back into society. Um, also with, you know, Empower in, uh, Beloved, which is a movement um, to educate young women throughout the school board. I'm so elated and happy to even be recognized with the elite, you know, Canadian artist. For the Toronto Sun, I'm Michelle Mandel.